A non-governmental organization called Elena Delight has trained women and youths in photography, especially with the knowledge on storytelling of their environment. This was done after a rally at the Unity Fountain in Abuja on the 13th to 15th of January 2022 to create awareness on the benefits of the green environment and its adverse effects like flooding, deforestation amongst others. Speaking to the media, the project's coordinator Isaac Abu highlighted the choice of the team Ewoye, which means Elena, Women and Youth Environmental Ambassadors, saying it speaks more of Mother Nature, the environment which has been neglected by many. Some environmental experts at the training said it was the first of its kind they had seen that women and youths are trained in digital photography skills and it's a welcome development. We had a light foundation event today is a great one for me. You know, environmental photography as Elena the Light Foundation has taken up upon themselves to teach women and youth is another dimension that has really been untapped, which this foundation has looked into and decided to take up the tax to train women and youth on environmental related issues so that we can all join and to save the whole planet we have. And this program today is really interesting because a lot of women and youth are being uh, latent behind in the environmental uh, issues and how can collectively tackle the issues related to environmental degradation. What we are witnessing here today by Elena the Light Foundation, this training being organized to empower young ladies, young women and youths on environmental photography is a very welcome innovation. For me, this is very, very innovative and uh, a bit big to use the word first of its kind. The Chairman National Union of Journalists, FCT Chapter Emmanuel Obeche, shed more light on the need to build capacity of young people on good reportage on the environment as it will aid enlightened people on the climate change and efforts of the government in that area. Um, in the COVID-19, I've experienced that there are so many gaps and issues in terms of environmental sustainability and um, engaging young women, you know, especially through photography, to depict what it is to be in a growing city like Abuja and in a rural community where there are lots of um, challenges, especially for girls and women. And it's very instructive. I think uh, we have the skills and then uh, during this period it's going to enhance uh, community um, meeting. And in turn, we become ambassadors, not just um, for the time being, you know, the true time because we need more ambassadors in terms of uh, environmental uh, sustainability to the, the prices of uh, domestic gas and so by the rooftop, people are selling trees and the environment is very tight and also energy. The participants who express excitement about the training promise the organizers that they will put in the work and become good ambassadors of the green environment. Ah! Yeah!